Hello everyone, it is I, Sakamoto. Welcome back to more Undertale Revisited with me, your boy, Sakamoto. Uh, last time on Undertale Revisited, we, uh, we got to the end, which is where we're at now. We're near the end of the game, but we need to do a couple of things. We need to go and see Temi, because we're going to get the Temi armor, because I hacked the game and got a bunch of money... So we could go do that. And the reason for that is because last time... I, the reason why I'm doing that is because last time I played the game, I got the Temi armor after I'd already beaten the game and there were no fights left. It was pointless at that point. But we're getting it now and then... Yeah. It's going to be awesome. Man, I love this song. I don't want to leave. I just want to chill and listen to this. Blah. So hard to pull away from things sometimes, you know? That song's cool too, and so is this one. Just just about like pretty much all the music in this game is just masterpiece after masterpiece. I um went and bought a bunch of junk food from Batty and Caddy, but we're gonna sell that to Tammy and get some better uh food stuff somewhere else. <laughs> Um, that's where we're gonna go. You betty, you betty, stop betty, blah, oops. God, hey, hey, what are you doing? Oh, can I, like, spend a night in the hotel? We're gonna do that, too. I forgot all about that. Yeehaw. No, wrong way. Oh, no. Oh, no. Ah, what were you going to say? Uh, okay, I guess I might have accidentally skipped it, pressed the wrong button. <clears throat> Come again sometime, tra -la, la Yes, take me to the waterfall, please. I'm sorry. I told you to go the wrong way. Tra la la, Timmy Village, the room before the Darkening Lantern Room. That is where we're going. I think this armor makes you virtually invincible, even at level 1, which is pretty rad, so. We're gonna have an easy time finding these, uh. finding who we're gonna have to fight from now on. I may have already spoiled some of that, but uh, I don't know. I won't say anything else. Um, let's see here. This way to Temi Village. This way to Temi Village. Here we are. Do bum do bum do bum do 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 do. Uh, uh, okay, so I'm gonna sell. Everything! You got Cinnabons! Hmm, I gotta have that Cinnabons. I gotta pay for college. Hmm, Ten always wants Cinnabons! Nine gold. Yeah! Oh wow. I know it could go above nine, 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 nine. Thanks for a test. Alright, give me that Tammy out there. Ten pay for college for a thousand gold. Yeah! Wow! That's a lot of months! Can I tell him really accepts? Okay! I'm gonna cause to make you pounce! And leaves my face behind. Ten back from Cool Egg. Ten learned many things. Ten learned to sell new item. Yeah! Okay, Timmy Armor for 7,000 gold. Yeah! Yeah! Thanks for Tess! Okay, uh. I'll be back. I got more junk food that I don't need. Uh, info. Demi armor. Armor defense 20. The cool things you can do with a college education. Raises attack when worn. Recovers HP every other turn. Invincibility up slightly. Oh, hell yeah. That's all I'm talking about. You done the Temi armor. Let's compare it to our stained apron. Armor defense 11. Heals 1 HP every other turn. So, yeah, the Temi armor combines, like, the cloudy glasses, the stained apron... What was the other thing it does? Uh, I already forgot. <laughs> Damn you, short-term memory loss. Oh well. 
It does another cool thing that I'm pretty sure is part of another... Oh, raises attack when worn. I think that's the manly bandana. Pretty sure. Um, dimensional box. Yeah, I bought a lot of junk food for no reason. I was thinking I was going to use it, but then I was like, no, you know what, I want to get the Tammy armor too. And so I got all this money that I can use to buy better, because the junk food only gives you 17 HP, so. No, um, sell. Yeah, we can sell the same apron. Oh, you got a junk food, and I gotta have that junk food. But I gotta pay for grad school, even though I already went. Hmm, Tim always wanted junk foods. <laughs> Thanks for buying my junk food, Tammy. Actually, you know, I think I'm gonna... I'll keep like three just in case, but I don't even think I need them. No, well, you can have all the junk food. I don't need them. I'll keep one. And I'll probably drop it later. Bye! Thanks, Tammy! Bum do bum do bum bum do bum do. Oh, those notes are kind of hard because you gotta go from like three different octaves really fast. Bum do bum do. Oh man. Yeah. That takes some practice to sing or wood. Let me see here. How, what kind of uh, healthy items do you got, my friend? 18 HP, 10 HP. Nope, I'm good. I need more than that. Have a nice. I'm gonna go see. Yeah, you know what? Let's go to Snowden. Maybe I should have went there in the first place. Because those cinnamon buds, I think they heal 25 HP. I could also get glam burgers, I suppose. Tra la la, the water's very wet today. Okay. <sighs> Come again sometime, Trella. He's still throwing those blocks of ice out there. I don't want to go visit the Bone Boys, but I need my cinnamon buns. Yay, 22 HP. This one does heals you twice. That's pretty cool, actually. Well, give me like four of those. All right. Bye now. Bye now. Come again sometime. Slap them. It has abs on it. <laughs> okay, I think we're good now. I think I'll leave room for other stuff if I need it. What did that say? You threw the junk food down on the ground like the trash that it is or something? It went by too quick. In that box we got that stuff. You know what? Let's go get some more. Alright, alright, alright. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Alright, let's go. Hey guys! Oh, hey! You're leaving soon, right? Don't come here to say goodbye! Goodbyes aren't allowed in my town! Just see you later! Hey, punk! What's up? Uh, achoo! Papyrus, how can you stand this cold? I have no skin! So, why don't we stand in Grillby's instead? Because I hate grease! But you don't have a stomach! No, but I have standards. You guys are so cute. See you guys later. There's a live Barbie. 
Light Barbie. Alright. Now to the end of the game. Oh no. I mean, after we accidentally go to Waterfall. <laughs> like, we actually went to Snowden and then we go to Hotland and then, yeah. Okay. Chala, why don't you sing with me? Chala. Put to Hotland, please. Thanks. Or did I go to Chala, Chili, Chile? I, did I go to Snowden accidentally on this take? Because I did, like, I messed up something I had to do a take before this. But then I was like, you know what? I'll just do this over. I only got, I only, like, got the Tammy armor. And then I was like, okay, I'm going to do this over, basically. All right. Uh, right floor three. Pete's Flamesman, what up, my guy? I'll always remember that you remembered. Okay, cool. You're welcome, finger guns. <laughs> oh yeah, we're gonna go to the hotel, that's right. Yes, we know, the elevator of the city is not working. Because of this incident, rooms are running at a special rate. 200 gold a room. <laughs> Still expensive as crap. Fabulous, we'll escort you to your room. Which makes it no sense because crap is crap and not something anyone would actually want to pay for you <laughs> or wait maybe I'm wrong there are weirdos out there and then you you think about that South Park episode <laughs> with uh, Tom Brady's spice melange and all that everybody's wanting to pay for that that's for sure Oh wow, he's like coming out all horizontal. <laughs> I forgot about that. Cute. It's a lamp. There's no light switch. It says that stars make their own light. Of course, Metaton would have something like that. It's some sort of giant bottle of perfume. Use the rectangle. The cap is so comically large, you can't open it. Well, that was fun. Thanks a million. Thanks a trillion. You hear shuffling. Seems like you can put something together there. But you didn't have anything appealing. Interesting. Yes, he does seem quite busy, Frisk. Doesn't he? What do glam burgers do? Starfang. He has 14 HP, very popular food. 27 HP for glam burger. Legendary hero 40 HP up. Oh, attack up. Please don't ask. Stake in the shape of Metaton's face. Why is this person trying to sell me something? This is a hamburger restaurant. I'm just trying to survive. I'm sorry. Haha. <laughs> it's against the rules to talk to customers who have bought anything. Well, give me a minute. I, I might buy some stuff. You abandoned the bicycle. Bicycle was thrown away. Do the bicycle on the ground like the piece of trash it is. That's what it said. Okay. Alright, we'll buy a legendary hero. And that sold out. We don't have any more. What? I only needed one? Okay. Oh, you know what? That stake in the shape of Metaton's face might have helped out with the Metaton fight. Uh, give me another legendary hero. Okay. How a spectacular day! Okay. Hmm. Give me some more of that stuff. I, I promise we won't be doing this for that long. I'm gonna go 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 go. I'm only gonna go in there one more time. And this is all I'm gonna get. Okay, 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 let's go, let's go, let's go. A sparkular day is what he says, that's right. Alright, to this way land. To over there's will. To going away to other places. Nia. Like Narnia. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Okay, now, after 17 minutes, or actually a lot less, uh, because I have to edit out, like, I don't know how much of the beginning, but whatever. Either way, here we are, the end of the game again. Well, hello, elevator. Elevator's in use. Elevator isn't working. That makes sense. It's in use, but it isn't working. Okay, got it. Hmm. Silence, to silence, to silence, 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 to silence, it's quiet. Do boo boo ba 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 do. Oh, it's not quiet anymore. New home. No determination thingy though. The way is blocked by two padlocks. There's a note attached. Howdy, I'm in the garden. If you have anything if you have anything you need to get off your chest, please don't hesitate to come. The keys are in the kitchen in the hallway. It's a golden flower. Yeah. Seems like gardening tools. There are photo albums, scrapbooks, books on how to make tea. The call, the call, the calls, the coals are still warm. It's a great reading chair, but it doesn't seem like anyone uses it. A long time ago, a human fell into the ruins. Injured by its fall, the human called out for help. You took the key and put it on your phone's keychain. The stove top is very clean. Someone must use fire magic instead. It's a trash can. It's full of crumpled up recipes for butterscotch pie. It's a note. Howdy, help yourself to anything you want. There is some white fur stuck in the drain. The fridge is full of unopened containers of snails. Aw. Ezreal, the king's son. Heard the human's call. He brought the human back to the castle. It's a golden flower. It's a golden flower. There's a heart shaped lock inside the box. Hmm. Oh no. Wait, can you drop stuff from inside the box? Damn it. Uh. If you're cuter, monsters won't hit you as hard. Hmm. Armor Defense 15, it says, Best Friends Forever. Look at that dude from Jazz, that's dude with the string in his back from Jazz Funk. <laughs> um, heart Locket. Yeah, okay. Hmm. Man, like Bandana. Armor Defense 7, it has seen somewhere, it has tabs drawn on it. Oh, yeah, that's right. Horn Dagger. Sure, you got the Horn Dagger. Attack 15, perfect for cutting plants and vines. Seal of Wildem, seal four more HP, wow. Well, maybe I will keep that then. Actually, I don't really need that. I got all them legendary heroes and stuff. What a comfortable bed. If you lay down here, you might not ever get up. It's a family photograph. Everyone is smiling. It's a drawing of a golden flower. There are a lot of striped shirts in here. Dusty toys. It's a golden flower. Room under renovations. 
Over time, Asriel and the human became like siblings. The king and queen treated the human child as their own. The underground was full of hope. You took the key and put it on your phone's keychain. Do not ask me how I did those voices without laughing. LMAOing. <laughs> Despite everything, it's still you. It's Ascor's journal. All the current page says is, Nice day today. The ink is still almost wet. It's just a chair. It's a king-size bed. Macaroni out of a flower. For King Dad. It's a bureau. There's a Santa Claus outfit inside. It's a clothes store. There are robes, spun up shirts, and a pink hand-knit sweater that says, Mr. Dad Guy. It's a clothes store. There are robes, spun up shirts. Okay. It's a trophy. Number one knows Nuzzle Champs 98. I'm very confused. Oh yeah, I think this... Never mind. Stuff gets explained anyway. Alright, let's go use the keys. You unlock the chain. There's an old calendar from the... There's an old calendar from the end of 21X. 2001X. Uh, data circle on it. Alright, let's see here. We've got the Warren Dagger, the Temi Armor. Should I? Oh crap. Hmm. Yeah, okay. Then, one day, the human became very ill. Oh, they're telling about it right now. The sick human had only one request, to see the flowers from the village. But there was nothing we could do. The next day, the next day, dot dot dot, the human died. Asriel, racked with grief, absorbed the human's soul. He transformed into a being with incredible power. With the human soul, Asriel crossed through the barrier. He carried the human's body into the sunset, back to the village of the humans. Asriel reached the center of the village. There, he found a bed of golden flowers. He carried the human onto it. Oh, their little face shields are so cute. Oh, I have to press. <laughs> Suddenly, screams rang out. The villagers saw Asriel holding the human's body. They thought that he had killed the child. The humans attacked him with everything they had. He was struck with blow after blow. Asriel had the power to destroy them all. But Asriel did not fight back. Clutching the human, Asriel smiled and walked away. We're dead. Asriel stumbled home. He entered the castle and collapsed. His dust, in, his dust spread across the garden. Sorry about that. The kingdom fell into despair. The king and queen had lost two children in one night. The humans had once again taken everything from us. The king decided it was time to end our suffering. Every human who falls down here must die. With enough souls, we can shatter the barrier forever. It's not long now. King Asgore. King Asgore will let us go. King Asgore will give us hope. King Asgore will save us all. You should be smiling too! Aren't you excited? Aren't you happy?
You're going to be free. You bitty, you bitty, scop bitty, schlop bitty, blue bitty, dot bitty, wop bitty, gop bitty. Where's that elevator take you? Well, let me save real quick. Yeah. Yeah! Okay. To where it was saying it wasn't going to be used. Got it. Or it wasn't used or it wasn't working. Alright guys, time for some... Well, you'll see in a second here. If you haven't seen this before, get ready for a surprise. Character. Character. <clears throat> so, you finally made it. The end of your journey is at hand. In a few moments, you will meet the king. Together, you will determine the future of this world. That's then. Now, you will be judged. You will be judged for your every action. You will be judged for every XP you've earned. What's EXP? It's an acronym. It stands for Execution Points. A way of quantifying the pain you have inflicted on others. When you kill someone, your EXP increases. When you have enough EXP, your love increases. Love, too, is an acronym. It stands for Level of Violence. A way of measuring someone's capacity to hurt. The more you kill, the easier it becomes to distance yourself. The more you distance yourself, the less you will hurt. The more easily you can bring yourself to hurt others. But you, you never gained any love. Of course, that doesn't mean you're completely innocent or naive. Just that you kept a certain tenderness in your heart. No matter the struggles or hardships you faced, you strive to do the right thing. You refuse to hurt anyone. Even when you ran away, you did it with a smile. You never gained love, but you gained love. Does that make sense? Maybe not. No. You're about to face the greatest challenge of your entire journey. Your actions here will determine the fate of the entire world. If you refuse to fight, Askor will take your soul and destroy humanity. But if you kill Askor and go home, monsters will remain trapped underground. What will you do? Well, if I were you, I would have thrown in the towel by now. But you didn't get this far by giving up, did you? That's right. You have something called determination. So as long as you hold on, so as long as you do what's in your heart, I believe you can do the right thing. Alright. We're all counting on you, kid. Good luck. Thanks, Sans. Love you, buddy. You're so cool, man. So freaking cool. So freaking cool! Sorry. <laughs> Like, how else do you explain Sans? He's just so freaking cool! <laughs> oh, man. So, over here is Bill, to this way, land of... other place in the, uh... throne room. Excuse me. I burped it in. We're gonna go visit over here real quick. It's a coffin. There's a name engraved on it. Kion. It's empty. So he already knows I'm here and I'm coming and I exist and he knows my name. This is great. That's not... Like, okay. Let's just... Wait, what does that say? Oh, it just says Thunder. That's right. Alright, we got health, we got... Hang on a second. I want to see if we can do this the first time we try it. We have to get... We have to actually fight Asgore, uh and get his health down. Um, to almost near him dying and then spare him, I believe. Dum-de-dum. -dum. Oh, is someone there? Just a moment. I have almost finished watering these flowers. Here we are! Howdy! How can I... Oh!
I so badly want to say, would you like a cup of tea? But, you know how it is. Nice day today, huh? Birds are singing. Flowers are blooming. Perfect weather for a game of catch. You know what we must do. When you are ready, come into the next room. You betty, you betty, scop betty, blop betty, shoot betty, wop betty, go betty, gop betty, do betty, up on a bow. It's another throne covered by a white sheet. It's a throne. How tense. Just think of it like a visit to the dentist. Yeah, okay, because I'm the one who's going to lose, right? I don't know, maybe he will beat me. I don't remember his patterns. Are you ready? I remember some of them. And the song, oh my gosh, the song that's about to play is so good. I think it's one of my favorites. If you are not, I understand. I am not ready either. Which isn't saying much, because like half the, at least half the songs I can probably say, like, this is one of my favorites about. Maybe all of them, I don't know. <laughs> this is the barrier. This is what keeps us all trapped underground. If... If by chance you have any unfinished business... Please, do what you must. Continue! I see. This is it, then. Ready? Yes, I am. I hope I am. A strange light fills the room. Twilight is shining through the dark barrier. <laughs> it seems your journey is finally over. You're filled with DETERMINATION! Human. It was nice to meet you. Goodbye. Yeah, whatever, I don't care. <laughs> Ask or attacks. That's not that bad, okay. Maybe I'm not gonna win. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> Okay, I remember a lot of these now. Okay, here we go. Fuck! I'm gonna die! No, I'm not. Alright, um... Hell yeah. Oh, what was that? Doesn't matter. Can't whistle right now. Maybe I should have just oh ah oh, crap, why did I move? I shouldn't have moved there. I should have only just had legendary heroes. Oh well. Damn he ain't even halfway dead yet. Shiznit! Fart knocking with fart knockers! Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Ah, fart knocking with fart knockers. Orange, orange, blue. I still got hit. Halfway down. About. Whatever. Shit. 
Ah! Save me! Yay. Okay, they're going faster now. Ah! I need to be able to attack you. Okay, good. Blue. Oh, why did I move? That was dumb. So then don't move, move, move. 13. Alright. Okay, down there. And over there. And over there. Ah, come on. Alright. We'll take it. There we go, I can whistle today. Still got hit, damn. I knew what the pattern was too, whatever. Whatever, whatever! Need another one, screw it. We're doing pretty good. Ah. You quietly tell Oscar you don't want to fight him. His hands trouble for a moment. Says he has low HP. What the, what the heck? Whatever. Hmm. His breathing gets funny for a moment. Really? I'm gonna have to hit him some more? Okay. That's fine. Yeah, there we go. Oh. Yeah, I won! I don't have to do this over again! Hell yeah! So... Sorry. <laughs> so that is how it is. I remember the day after my son died. The entire underground was devoid of hope. The future had once again been taken from us by the humans. In a fit of anger, I declared war. I said that I would destroy any human that came here. I would use their souls to become godlike and free us from this terrible prison. Then I would destroy humanity and let monsters rule the surface in peace. Soon, the people's hopes returned. My wife, however, became disgusted with my actions. She left this place, never to be seen again. Truthfully, I do not want power. I do not want to hurt anyone. I just wanted everyone to have hope. But, I cannot take this any longer. I just want to see my wife. I just want to see my child. Please, young one. This war has gone on long enough. You have the power. Take my soul and leave this cursed place. After everything I have done to hurt you, you would rather stay down here and suffer than live happily on the surface? Human, I promise you, for as long as you remain here, my wife and I will take care of you as best we can. We can sit in the living room telling stories, eating butterscotch pie. We could be like... like a family. Ah, uh, what the heck, man. You idiot! You haven't learned a thing! In this world, it's kill or be killed. <laughs> I am Ingio Montoya. You killed my father. Prepare to die. As soon as I turn the game back on, because I forgot that it does that. Oh man, damn you, Flowey. Long ago, two races ruled over the earth, humans and monsters. One day, they all disappeared on the trace. Brrr. 
continue or restart. That's cool. Flowey, my world, level nine 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 nine. Oh, hang on a second. I can't pause. Damn it. So uh, you better let me go into my dimensional box and get more health atoms. If you're gonna make me fight you right now. Okay, so for Father's voice, I'm gonna be changing it up. Uh, he's like this amalgamation of crazy, like, souls and all this other stuff. So his voice goes like, "Whoa, it's gonna get crazy, guys." I just want to warn you. And if it doesn't sound good, I'm sorry. Howdy, it's me, Flowery. Flower the flower. I owe you a huge thanks. You really did a number on that old fool. Without you, I never could have gotten past him. But now, with your help, he's dead. And I've got the human souls. Boy, I've been empty for so long. Feels great to have a soul inside me again. Hmm, I can feel them wriggling. Aw, oh, you're feeling left out, aren't you? Well, that's just perfect. After all, I only have six souls. I still need one more. Before I become God. And then, with my newfound powers, monsters, humans, everyone, I'll show them all the real meaning of this world. See, I think it's cool. Oh, and forget about escaping your old save file. It's gone forever. But don't worry, your old friend Flowey has worked out a replacement for you. I'll save over your own death so you can watch me tear you to bloody pieces over and over and over. What? Do you really think you can stop me? <laughs> you really are an idiot. You're not gonna let me go to my box. I need more health items, you little poop. How am I supposed to do anything without more health items? Well, maybe we'll be alright. I think Ascor might even be harder than this, technically. But we'll see. Oh, Jesus. Okay. No. No thank you. No thank you. I can't even use health items right now anyways. I need to not die! Okay. Uh... Ow. Okay, here we go. Something's happening. Okay, don't get hit by any of this. Ah, shiznit. You called for help. Okay, cool. I don't think that took any health. Hey, stop! Ouch. Okay, I guess it's not that bad. Yay, healthiness. We're gonna be okay, everyone. Ah, shiznit. Oh, frick knockers. Hey, look at that. Flies! I don't like flies. Going into those Venus fly traps. Okay. <gasps> Bombs! Okay. That's such cool, like, drum right there. Where is the thingy? There it is. You call for help. You bitty, you bitty, scuppity, bloppity, shloopity, shloppity. Oh no, I need more help than that. Ah! Fell saved. Okay. Fell too saved. Oh no, fell loaded. Damn you, Flowey. Give me that fight button. Well, oh, I guess I don't need it. Okay. 
Okay, I can't go above that. Ow. Owie. Whatever. Loop a doop 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 a That's okay, I think it's gonna be loaded from like where we just were basically. This is all just a bad dream. And you're never waking up. I think it's gonna reset the game though. I turn it off again. Hee hee hee. Did you really think I was gonna be satisfied? Killing you only one time? Man, these are the patterns of the... How far back? Oh man, this is the beginning of the fight. Lame. Or is it? Whatever. Okay, we haven't been here yet. Cool. You called for help. Damn it, give me the health! I'm gonna die! Damn it! Damn you, Flowey. Come on. Yeah. Now that's what I'm talking about. Much better. What are those things? Finger guns with flowers on top of them? Oh my god, the bombs. Uh. Oh god, here we go. Jump for the targets. That's where the bullets are gonna go. Shit. I'm eating my woods. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Help me, yellow flower heart. Soul. Really? That is not helpful. Great, thanks. Or is it? Yay, we're done. With all that. I think. Yay! Yay, 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 yay. Thank you, everyone. Happiness flows through me now. And then we got you again. Wow, his defense dropped to zero. Thanks for giving me the fight button. And health. really how you win? Ah, stop it! Ow!
How do you like me now, Sally? No! No! This can't be happening! Ew. Ew! Troll face. Full health. You idiot! <laughs> the Tommy Wiseau laugh. <laughs> <laughs> Do you really think you could defeat me? Oh, the god of this world! And you? You're hopeless. Hopeless and alone. Golly, that's right. You're worthless friends. I'll save you now. Help, help, I dare you. Cry into the darkness. Mama, Daddy, somebody help! See what good it does you. You called for help. But, but nobody came. Boy, what a shame. Nobody else is gonna get to see you die. <gasps> what? How do you? Well, I'll just... Load failed. Oh, excuse me, I burped. Where are my powers? The souls? What are they doing? No, no! I'm just gonna go back to this regular voice. You can't do that! You're supposed to obey me! Stop! Stop it! Stop! <laughs> IDK. <laughs> I'm having a blast. This is great. Okay, let's give him mercy. What are you doing? Do you really think I've learned anything from this? No. Sparing me won't change anything. Killing me is the only way to end this. If you let me live, I'll come back. Where are we? Are we, like, in the middle of some, like, oasis of, like, really windiness or something? I don't know. I'll kill you! I'll kill everyone! I'll kill everyone you love! Okay, buddy. Whatever you say. Question mark? Why? Why are you being so nice to me? I can't understand. I can't understand. I just can't understand. Flowey ran away. Uh, okay. To over here land, then. Doom doom. Right? Yeah, I thought so. Okay. What the hey? Is this the credits? What the hey hey is going on? What the hey hey is happening? What the hey hey is going on? What the hey hey is happening? Do 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 ba do ba do ba do ba 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 da ba da ba ba da 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 da. Brian Gray, you Scott Miller, Audrey Wayner, Brian Koya, but I want to say Cola. Ring ring. Hello. Is anyone there? Well, I'll just leave a message. So, it's been a while. The Queen returned, and is now ruling over the underground. She's instated a new policy. All the humans who, f all the humans who fall here will be treated not as enemies, but as friends. It's probably for the best anyway. The human souls the King gathered seem to have disappeared. 
So, uh, that plan ain't happening anytime soon. But even though people are heartbroken over the king, and things are looking grim for our freedom, the queen's trying her best not to let us give up hope. So, uh, hey, if we're not giving up down here, don't give up wherever you are, okay? Who knows how long it will take, but we will get out of here. Sans, who are you talking to? Oh, nobody. What? Nobody? Can I talk to them too? Hmm, knock yourself out. Wait a second. I recognize this number. Attention, human. I, the Great Papyrus, am now captain of the Royal Guard. It's everything I've ever dreamed of. Except, instead of fighting, we just water flowers. So that's ever so slightly different. And we're helping Dr. Alphys with her research. She's gonna find. She's gonna find a. Sorry. She's gonna find a way to get us out of here. Undyne is helping her too. Though, to be honest, her method of helping seems kind of explosion inducing. But I think Alphys likes having her around. Uh oh. Hey, what are you up to, punk? Yeah! Please don't noogie the phone. Hey, who's in charge here? Me? Oh, yeah, that's right. I quit my job as leader of the Royal Guard. Actually, since we won't be fighting anymore, the Royal Guard totally disbanded. There's, uh, only one member now. But he's extremely good! Yeah, he is. Come here. Please don't noogie the skeleton. Anyways, now I'm working as Alphys' lab assistant. We're gonna find a way out of this dump once and for all! Oh, yeah, and I'm a gym teacher at the Queen's new school. Did you know I can best- <laughs> Did you know I can bench press seven children? Awesome, right? Dot dot dot. Hey, I'm sorry about what happened with Ascor. You were just doing what you had to. It's not your fault he- Ah, oh, darn it. I miss the big guy. Come on, Undyne, snap out of it! Uh, I guess I'll tell you how Alphys is doing. Well, she's the same as ever. Maybe a little more reclusive than normal. Seems like something's really bothering her. But she can get through it. I'm there supporting her. That's what friends are for, right? Hey, wherever you are. I hope it's better than here. It took a lot of sacrifice for you to get there. So, wherever you are, you have to try to be happy, okay? For our sakes, we'll feel better knowing our trouble was worth it. We're all with you, everyone is, even the Queen. Hey, wait a second. Toriel, Toriel, do you want Heh, <laughs> she says she's busy. But if she knew who you were talking to... We wouldn't get the phone back for at least a few hours. We have the mercy to spare you from her. But call back any time, okay? She'd love to talk. Oh, whoops. This thing's almost out of batteries, so hate to cut this short, but be seeing you, okay, buddy? Bye bye for now! See ya, punk! Click. Why? Why did you let me go? Don't you realize that being nice just makes you get hurt? Look at yourself. You made all these great friends, but now you'll probably never see them again. Not to mention how much they've been set back by you. Hurts, doesn't it? If you had just gone through without caring about anyone, you wouldn't have to feel bad now. So I don't get it. If you really did everything the right way, why did things still end up like this? Why? Is life really that unfair? Say, what if I told you I knew some way to get you a better ending? You'll have to lose... You'll have to load your save file in. Well, in the meantime, why don't you go see Dr. Alphys? It seems like you have, you could have been better friends. Who knows? Maybe she's got the key to your happiness. See you soon. <laughs> huh. Alright guys, that is going to do it for this episode of Undertale Revisited. We come back. 
actually might do two more episodes because I just remembered I have to go through a whole nother dungeony type thing and that might just be the whole next episode and then we might do the ending after that or I might do it all at once I don't know either way I'll see you guys later today if you want for the no commentary version of this at 3 p.m. and or I'll see you again tomorrow and or I'll see yeah and or like and slash or I'll see you again tomorrow for the next episode at 10 a.m. Eastern 3 p.m. Eastern. Eastern, Eastern, Eastern. I, I, always, I forget to... I forget that, like... Yeah. I always have to mention that, because... I have no idea where anyone is watching this from. <laughs> Anyways. Um, thanks so much for watching. Come back tomorrow for... Uh, the next part. Okay. <laughs> I'm sleepy, as usual. Thanks so much for watching. I really appreciate it. You guys mean the world to me. Love you guys. Have a great...